tattoos. Hey guys, Kevin Watson here, pro trainer. I'm with The Desire Company. Uh, I want to show you guys how to put it all together, right? We've learned uh, the basics of movements, we've learned the jab, the cross, all of those things. Now we want to put together in what we call shadow boxing. First thing, just start nice and loose, right? Try to think and be very intentional with your movements, move around, guard stays up, right? As you get more comfortable, you can start to circle to the right, circle to the left. Remember, lead with that foot, whichever direction you're moving in. Think situationally. Think about someone standing in front of you. Once you've got that down, you've moved, trying to cover as much ground as you can, you're staying balanced, guard is staying up. Then you can start bringing in the punches, right? Move around, stick that jab out there. You can throw a single, you can throw double jabs, go jab high, jab low. Now we know how to throw the one and the two. If I'm jabbing, I can put the two behind it, move it around. Use that jab to kind of set up, set up those power punches, then back to movement, right? You throw the two to lead. Once you're comfortable there, progress through, start bringing the hooks in. Right, back to movement, move the feet. Think about changing angles, facing different walls in the room. Mix up your combos, staying nice and loose, staying nice and relaxed. Mix it up, again, think progressions, right? Get your movement down, get comfortable there, then start throwing your jab, then start bringing the two in behind the jab, then start bringing the hook in once you've got that. But get the movement, get the jab, get the ones and the twos, and then bring the hook in. So that is the basics of movement, putting it all together. Great exercise, as you can see, I'm out of breath now. I've hardly done anything, but really great exercise, great job. Work that way, you'll progress. You'll be boxing like a pro in no time.